guys, it's Rebecca Louise and welcome to my channel. I'm here at Candlehoo in the Maldives. Oh yeah, check this out. You get your very own hut over the ocean. It's so amazing and today I'm going to be taking you through a 10 minute workout that is going to work that chest and that back. Oh yeah, so I don't have weights with me. It doesn't matter when you travel, I've just got water bottles. So that's a great tip for me from today. If you don't have any weights, remember to you just use some water bottles or fill them up with sand. Okay, we're going to start off. We're going to grab those water bottles or weights if you've got them. Okay. Okay, and we have got to go through 10 minutes. So you are gonna stay with me the whole time. We're gonna get our legs nice and wide, okay? Slight bend in that knee, and those arms out to the side, and we're just gonna push up to the top, and then bring down at that 90 degree angle. So make sure that your back isn't sticking out, everything is tucked under, and we're just gonna lift up, squeeze, and down. So there is 10 minutes on the clock. We're gonna breathe through the whole thing. You are gonna get through this with me. We're gonna be working those shoulders, working that chest, feeling so good and feeling so strong. And of course, you are gonna be feeling the burn. So make sure that you hashtag, I can feel the burn, Rebecca, after you've done this workout. Okay, push all the way up to the top and bring it down. So those arms wanna be nice and straight as you get to the top. I've still got that slight bend in the knee. My hips are tucked under and I'm just really working those shoulders and squeezing everything up and down. Okay, so you can start off with two pound weights, three pounds, and then work your way up and getting a little bit heavier so those last few reps are challenging. Okay guys, are you ready? Are you fired up? I am ready to go. So we are gonna bring those arms out in front. That's it, so squeeze. So open up that chest, really use those shoulders, use that back and squeeze. Ooh, okay guys, we are gonna feel it all the way through. I want you to stay with me. The 10 minutes is going to pass, okay? And all you have to do is stick with me. Okay, so we're just squeezing in for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, release those arms. Now you're gonna take it out into a V. So that's it, so we're just taking it up to the side, opening up that chest, and using those shoulders, using that back. We are working the shoulders today, guys. We're working the back. We're working that chest as well. And if you are part of the 30 Day Get Fact Plan, if you're part of my app doing the amazing fitness calendar, where if you complete 30 days in a row, there are like prizes like Fitbits and iPads and so many awesome, amazing stuff. So make sure you check out the link below. It's gonna give you your own personal fitness calendar that's gonna track your progress as well. Okay, keep squeezing. That's it, really keep the lower part of your body nice and still. And we're just gonna lift all the way up to the top. Okay, you've got this. Squeeze for three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna take it out to the side. So extend and then bring it back. Are those arms starting to be a little bit on fire? Oh yes, they are. Tuck those hips underneath, bring those arms together and squeeze out. So you want to keep your arms nice and straight. If the weights are too heavy and it's making your arms bend, then just relax and drop those weights down to the ground. You're still going to get a great workout whilst you're also just using no weights at all. Okay, so let's keep going out and in. Squeeze. That's it. Open up that chest. Really using those shoulders. We've got so many incredible exercises coming for you. So do not stop now. Those results are going to be the end of the workout. You've got five. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, rotate those shoulders. Let's do a little bit of arm stuff, okay? So we're just gonna bring those weights in here and then push all the way up to the top. Okay, drop it down. That's it, so your palms are facing upwards. Those hips are tucked underneath. You bring it in towards your chest, up to your shoulders, and then push all the way up to the sky and take it down. So just look straight forward. Try and keep that head in line and we're just moving those arms. So keep everything nice and still. You've got this, guys. Okay, any different workout that you do, you're gonna be able to get through it if you just keep moving your body, okay? So even if you're just gonna be up and down here, no worries. I just want you to keep doing things throughout the 10 minutes. That is the most important thing. Okay, pushing all the way up to the top. Squeeze it down. And up to the top. You've got three more. And if this is not hard enough, then all you need to do is just increase those weights. Okay, one more, all the way up to the top. Okay, we're gonna hold it up here, and we're gonna squeeze in and out. Oh yes, breathe, guys. Come on, you've got this. For 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and release all the way down. Rotate those shoulders. Okay, 
we're gonna drop down to the ground okay we've got some more amazing exercises for working that chest and that back coming straight through to you so lie all the way down okay we're gonna put those arms right here and we're just gonna push up and then take it down oh yes yeah. so if this is not heavy enough for you you might want to put some sand in your water bottles you might want to invest in some weights okay something that's going to challenge you and remember if it doesn't challenge you it doesn't change you oh yes absolutely love that quote so make sure that you are using something that's going to push you if these workouts are too easy you've got to increase that weight and it's not that you're going to get huge and bulky trust me guys you have got to lift some serious amount of weight and eat a lot of lot of food uh, to really get huge and bulky so we are halfway there and let's keep pushing up to the top you've got five four three two and one okay we're gonna hold it up the top here and you're gonna take it all the way down to the back take those uh, hips tucked underneath really push your belly button into the spine and then bring it up to the top so this is really important that your back doesn't come off the ground you're gonna squeeze in and nice and tight hold everything still and then we're just gonna move those arms down out the side to your shoulders and then bring all the way back up again so take it nice and slow and controlled we don't need to rush here we're just really trying to keep those arms straight and if your arms are bending, it means that your weight is just a little bit too heavy. So just drop them down and keep your arms moving with me. Oh my goodness, guys, you're gonna feel so amazing after you've got through this. We're gonna combat this together. I'm not going anywhere, neither are you. And remember to check in with me. I love seeing your transformation pictures on Facebook and Instagram. You can just send them through to me and we wanna feature you guys. Okay, we're gonna take it all the way down to the bottom and we're gonna pulse just up and down. Oh yes it's starting to kick in you can feel it in those shoulders squeeze those abs now if your back is coming off the ground i just want you to take it up a little bit higher with those pulses okay and if your back is nice and firm on the ground you can start to take it lower down so that's it belly button in towards the spine push that back and here we go we've got a pulse for 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 okay we're going to go in and out oh yes We've got this. So you're gonna take it out on a 45 degree angle and then bring it back in again. Really work in those shoulders, guys. Keep everything pulled into the ground. Your belly button is really pulled into the back of that spine and there is no gap underneath you. You've got 10, nine, eight, seven, count with me. Six, five, four, three, two, and one okay you're gonna bring it all the way up to the top and you can now take it out to the side okay so you're gonna have your palms they're gonna come and meet together so you just open it out okay so palms are facing up to the top and bring it in <sighs> nice and gentle guys take your time with this it's just a nice slow and controlled motion so bring it up to the top and then we're gonna take it slowly down to the side oh yes pulse it up to the top and gently bring it down to the side. You always want to keep those palms facing up. Now really make sure that your feet are nice and flat on the floor, you've got some support, and of course that back is staying really tight and secured. So if I stuck my hand underneath it, I would not be able to get it back out. Okay, we're gonna hold it down here. That's it, and pulsing. Small little pulses, working those shoulders, opening up that chest. Take a breath in, and as you breathe out, guys, give me a little bit of a smile. Oh yes, I know that you're in agony. I know that you can feel the burn, but this is where those results start to kick in. You've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring those weights all the way up and we're gonna come into a sitting position to pop those weights to the side and we're gonna flip over onto our stomach. So we're gonna do some push-ups. So you're gonna come nice and wide, probably just the other side of your mat. You're gonna come either up onto your toes or you're gonna stay onto your knees. Okay, and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna open that chest, come down, and then explode all the way up, okay? So it's gonna be nice and slow on the way down, and push it up. So just come as far as you can, really try and keep that back in a nice straight line, and then taking it down slowly, and push. Come on guys, you've got three more here, and you're gonna just get stronger each time. Take it all the way down, and push. One more, and now hold it down here. That's it, really squeeze, pull that belly button in for five, four, three, two, one, explode. And we're gonna come up to standing for our last exercise. 
pick up those weights all the way up to the top. You've just got less than 60 seconds to go. Oh my goodness, you can do this. Okay, so we're gonna bring back where we were at the beginning. So those arms come all the way up and we're gonna take them down and then out to the side. So push to the top, down and squeeze those shoulders back together. Push all the way up to the top, take it down and bring those arms out to the side. We're gonna push it up and breathe in and out guys. You've got this. Last 20 seconds to go of this workout and then you are complete. And if you are on the 30 day get fit plan, then it's gonna make sure that you tick off, that you've done the workout, it's gonna electronically calculate it for you and then you can share the congratulations banner. So awesome. Okay, last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yes, up in the air. Put those weights down. Give yourself a pat on the back because you guys did amazing. Make sure you check out my 30 day get fit plan, my app, all the details about what I eat and my fitness plan are all on there. Have a wonderful day guys and I will see you guys on the next workout. Stay fit.